make it another video for you guys. Yes, I am wearing the same outfit as I was in in the last video because this is all being filmed the same day. I'm not gonna bother changing outfits because I really could be bothered right now because it is quite late at night. I'm trying to get all these videos done as soon as possible. Today we are doing a shopping haul. We have not done a shopping haul in a long time. And I am very excited to do a shopping haul because I haven't done one in a very long time. And the last one I did was like two years ago. Um, but we're gonna get back to our roots because I was known for doing my Hot Topic and H&M hauls. Today we have something different. We are doing a Sephora haul. Yes, we are doing a haul of Sephora. Now some of these products are mainly Fenty Beauty, but there are some other random ones. Um, so we're going to start with whatever I grab first out of the bag. First up, we have Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. Of course, our Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter. This is in the shade Chills, so I'm going to take this out of the box right now and show it to you guys. Now, I did look at these shades because they have testers, like things you could look at, um, out right now. But it is this beautiful silver shade. Let me see if I can... That's better. Okay, this silver shade. Ugh. So here is our Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Kilowatt Highlighter in Chills. This is my third Fenty Beauty Highlighter. My other ones are uh, Wood Brat and Trophy Wipe. So I'm going to be trying this out as soon as I possibly can. Um, I am a big fan of this shade. It was actually between this shade and a second one, which was... um. I can't remember what that one was called. I think it was a white shade. It was between this and that one. I had Cameron picked and he picked this one over the white one. So I'm very much excited to use that. So we'll put that over there so I don't pick it up again. Next we have this. Oh, I think this accidentally opened. Oh no, damn it. Okay, hopefully it hasn't gone bad or spilled everywhere. I don't think it has. Um, so this is the Soy Fleece Cleanser from Fresh. If you remember my skincare video, if any of y'all watch that, um, this is actually the larger size of the facial wash I used. I was able to find a bigger size. Now, this isn't the biggest one they had. The biggest one they had was like $38. This was a cheaper version for $12 that Cameron found for me. Um, so this is the, it also removes, um, makeup and everything um i think this is the right one that instantly wicks away everyday impurities i makeup even mascara yes so this is the right one um i'm a very big fan of this facial wash i do use it a lot and the small bottle i had i had almost ran out of so i got this one as soon as i could um it was available and this was in a Sephora at the South Park Mall in Charlotte, so I don't know if I'd be able to find this at the smaller Sephora in my mall, um, but I definitely look for it again and get to try that out as soon as I can. Next, we actually have another Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. This is the Slip Shine Sheer Shiny Lipstick. Now, this is my first lipstick from Fenty Beauty. I usually I get lip glosses, but... Cameron picked this out for me. This is in the shade. Oh, I can't even read it. The shade on the box. This is in the shade Sugar Kiss. So it is this beautiful, like, Barbie pink. If you can see that, I'd look like this Barbie pink color. Oh my god, gorgeous, stunning, wonderful, great. Anyways, Cameron picked this out for me, and I was like, yes, bitch, so pretty. I have not used a lipstick from Fenty Beauty before, so I cannot wait to try this out um, and add it on to my new pink lipsticks. I mean, I'll get rid of my old ones and replace it with this, because that's what I usually do. Next, we actually have another Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. This is a Gloss Bomb Heat. It's a universal lip luminizer and plumper. I tried to sign a store. This is in the shade Hot Cherry. This is the first one I think they've released of something like this. So this is a lip plumper. So it's less a, it's less a lip gloss and more a plumper. If you don't know what that is, they sell them a lot. But 
as you can see, this is the shade. It's this beautiful hot red shade. And with a plumper, it's meant to like, you put it on and it tingles and it makes your lips look bigger. Um, so I'm very interested in trying that out and seeing how that looks. Um, because I tried out in store and it felt like really nice. Um, if you don't know, I have a boyfriend and men are stupid and he didn't know that lip glosses can be colored and he thought they all came in clear, which is funny. This is another Fenty Beauty. This is the Gloss Bomb Cream. So this is a creamy lip gloss. Um, double Take Lip Duo. This is the shades Bubble Binge and Cupcake. And so I'll show you both of these. So first one out, we have Cupcake. And actually, so it's this nudie pink shade. Very beautiful. Um, I don't have any of these shades. I made sure I didn't get any duplicates. So here it is for you. I don't have another light on, so I can't really see. Um, I might turn another light on real quick just like a lamp or something this is in the shade cupcake in it's like a like a pinky nude kind of color and then this shade oh i am very excited for this one because this one is a hot pink and y'all know i love me some pink i love me um pink lip glosses and pink crazy shit so y'all already know, I'm gonna love this one. I'm just trying to put this back in. This is Bubble Binge, bitch. Is that what it's called? Bubble Binge. Look at this. So this is a cream, not really a lip gloss, but look at that. Look at how pink that is. I cannot wait to try that because that looks gorgeous. Flipping gorgeous, ladies and gentlemen. Flipping gorgeous. Okay, that was. Oof, that shade is beautiful. Love that. And then, last thing is actually not really a beauty product, but it is. This is the Blender Cleanser in Liquid Charcoal. So, this is actually like. I think it's. I think it's a black like formula maybe and it's basically the same as blender cleanser but I haven't used this one before I used a clear one same brand and everything that I use but mine is a clear one I think it's the lavender one but this is a charcoal one I think this one is supposed to work better I just gotta make sure I read the directions yeah it's supposed to be super concentrated but it's supposed to be like a lot better than a regular one. So I'm going to try that out on one of my beauty blenders. Maybe tomorrow or maybe like a little bit later than that. Maybe later in the week. And I'll give y'all a review of those products. Or maybe if y'all want me to do reviews of those products. Um, I can do a review of all the like lip glosses. Um, or I could like compare different shades from different brands and be like hey this one looks like this so this is like the dupe of it um so yeah I could do that but while I'm here I'll just do this because it's right next to me um I didn't just go to Sephora I also went to Lush and I got this shower scrub in orange I really hope it doesn't make a mess like it actually smells more like tangerine more than orange but this is what it looks like so if you don't know what a shower scrub is, it's basically like, you kind of use it as a body wash almost, so you like scrub it on and everything, but it's meant to be a little bit more exfoliating than a body wash because it's a scrub. Um, I got that too while I was at that mall, so I just wanted to show you both of those. But this was mainly a Sephora haul. Um, I love Sephora. It's one of my favorite places in the world. and. Cameron has to drag me out of there sometimes because I spend too much money. I mean, that Sephora stuff alone was $142 <laughs> for just how many products? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six products is $142. So if you do the math, that's like 20 something dollars a piece. Um... Yeah, Fenty B is expensive, but it's worth it. And I will stand by that every single day. Do I have bags under my eyes? Shit. 
I've been working a lot. I've been waking up really early in the morning lately. So, um, yeah, I'm making bad decisions. Wonderful. Anyways, I hope you guys like this video. Um, if you like my shopping hauls, please like and subscribe for more of them. I'm gonna be posting another shopping haul after this. Um, that's gonna be a shopping haul of something else. Um, a different actual brand. Um, so if y'all are interested in more shopping hauls, please like this video and subscribe for more. Um, comment what videos I should make next. Do you want more shopping hauls or reviews or is there like a certain kind of video y'all want me to make? Because I know some people love the stuffed animal videos. Some people like the makeup videos, but not as much. Um, some people like the collection videos. Some people like the shopping hauls. Some people like the reviews. So it's whatever y'all like. I just make videos because they're fun. I really don't once you start caring about the views and the likes and everything, it stops being as fun. And I don't really care, except I do. It's like, oh, I'm really sad that video didn't do as well. What can I do to improve and make you guys want to watch more videos, okay? Is there a certain type of video I should be making? Is there a certain type of video y'all hate? Do y'all hate the makeup videos? Do y'all even like them? Am I not promoting more enough? I mean, I post every video on Tumblr and Twitter. I post on Twitter like three times. I put links in my bios of all of my social media accounts. So if you want something quicker, you could just click the link in the bios of all of my social media accounts for my latest video. Um, I just want to know what y'all want and I want to make content that you guys like. Um, so let me know. Let me know what y'all want. Hit the notification bell for a new video every week. I know I'm wearing the same outfit in like four videos or three. I'm not going to film four. I'm just going to film three today and I'll film the fourth one like tomorrow or something. I'm oof, burning the candle at both ends, babe. Um, but, uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Um, yeah, hit the notification bell and follow the social media links in the description below if you want to. Um, I'm gonna stop putting my Instagram on there, because Instagram is a little bit more personal. But I'm still gonna have my Tumblr blog, my fandom blog, my other blog, my TikTok down there, as always, and my Twitter. Um, those are still gonna be down there. Everything beginning with a T. Everything beginning with a T down there. Um, I'm gonna put a link to my latest shopping haul, which was ages ago. And I'm gonna put a link to a playlist in my shopping haul right here for you. And if you can't get these, then they'll be in the description below. Just drop down and they'll be at the very bottom. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. And I can't wait to see y'all again. Okay, go film another video now. Bye!